Kazakhstan's capital Astana hosted the second day of the Kazakhstan Berizi Grand Slam at the Baris Arena. Young judoka and local fans filled the stadium elated to see their heroes. And the IGF took advantage of the occasion to present the seventh Dan diploma to Olympic silver medalist Askat Zhitkiev for his contribution to the development of judo in Kazakhstan and internationally. Korea's Kim Jisoo defeated Katharina Heike to take the under-63 kilo gold, catching her Australian opponent twice with a driving and hooking Uuchigari to take her first-ever Grand Slam gold. Yesit Baikan, Astana City's deputy mayor, awarded the medals. Makhmadbek Makhmadbekov made it two consecutive IGF World Tour victories at under 73 kilos with a turnover and pin on Poland's Adam Stodolski. Askat Zhitkiev, Kazakhstan Judo Federation General Secretary, handed out the medals. Greece's Ilsevet Teltsitidou was on blistering form all day at under 70 kilos. This trademark hip throw, the highlight of her route to the final. There she defeated the Dutch Olympic bronze medalist Sanna van Dijker to take her second Grand Slam gold of the year. Armen Bagdasarov, IGF head referee director, gave out the medals. Kazakhstan crowd was really warm and cheering for me in the final. I want to thank them. They're, it's a different feeling. Tajikistan's Somon Makhmadbekov also made it two IGF World Tour victories in a row at under 81 kilos. After defeating a former Olympic champion on his way to the final, he won gold with a tactical victory over Brazil's rising star, Gilham Schmidt. Mohamed Meridia, IGF Education and Coaching Director, awarded the medals. I want to thank the Kazakh crowd, said Mahmoud Bekov. They motivated me. I also saw some of my fans and I'd like to thank them as well. Kazakhstan built on its day one success with two bronze medalists at under 73 kilos. A beautiful moment of judo followed by a great display of sportsmanship. The crowd in Astana appreciating their heroes putting it all on the line. The final day in Kazakhstan looks set to be a stunner.